Okay, so hello there, everybody, and welcome back to Mass Effect. Uh, last time, we picked up our assassin squad mate, Thane Krios, the Drell right here, um, and we uh, we did some hacking for Liara Tassoni, and we bought some stuff from the terminals, but I think what we're going to have to do is we're going to go get our uh, Asari Justicar Samara next. If this is the best you have, I'll make do. So, certain the neural stimulators I think we have to go to, yeah, okay. Suit and sorry we gotta go back to, um... <sighs> shut up, you stupid bullets. <laughs> Honestly, I do kind of wish they wouldn't be as, um... Do you? It wouldn't, it, they only did that, like, once when you entered an area, as opposed to every time that you pass them repeating the same conversations, because it does get kind of annoying after a while. I don't know if you can turn that off, actually, but I, I didn't want to because I wanted people to be able to do it. Because some of them, as you've well seen, are fucking hilarious. Like Conrad Werner getting, falling into a, basically a trash turbine because he's a fucking idiot. Um, alright, let's go. For example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? Yeah, that it's sounds horrible. sexy. There's that sounds really sexy. Let's not do that. A waiver for you. Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or did she kill somebody already? Relax, I just need to speak with her. Good. Samara's the first Justicar I've seen on Ilium. If I'm lucky, things will stay peaceful. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. Is Samara really that dangerous? If you follow the laws, you've got nothing to fear. And a Justicar would die without hesitation to protect the innocent. But their code orders them to stop lawbreakers, with lethal force in most cases. And everyone skirts the law somehow on Ilium. If someone tried to bribe her, she'd be obliged to gun them down as a matter of honor. I'm hoping to avoid that. I'm looking for Samara. Like I said, she's at the commercial. You can hail a cab at the pedestal on that balcony uh, over there. Let's just hail a cab. All right, we're going to go pick up our Asari Justicar. Hopefully get some more money as well. All right, so we haven't really had Thane with us for that long, so I'm going to bring him along on this one as well. And yes, it does look like Samara is our second to last squad mate we will have. Okay, Thane's fine. Where do you think you're going? I'm taking my goods to Omega, Detective. You're not going anywhere, Merchant. Not until I solve this murder. I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. The victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. I'll let you know when you can leave. What about that Justicar that just showed up? Everyone says she might go crazy and start killing. I need to leave. She'll only kill the unjust, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. Bitch, what you looking at? What you looking at? I'm wearing a gift mask, it's okay. Alright, before I go talk to the Volus, I'm going to examine the area. I have a funny feeling there's something I can pick up around here. Korean worker. Cops don't admit it, but the Eclipse sisters run this area. Oh, that's lovely. Spaceport official. I'm not going to talk to them quite yet. It's over this way. Okay. Nope. Okay, it's just an area you can go. Let's pop in here for a second. I think as long as I don't talk to her, I think I'm fine. Medical supplies. And I have a weapons locker for loadout, but I'm good on loadout. And nothing over here. Okay. So first things first, I'm going to go talk to the Volus, because the Volus was having some issues, so let's let's have a chit-chat with him. What do you want? I've already got mercs wanting to kill me like they did my partner. I don't need any more trouble. 
As if that weren't enough, some Asari Justicar showed up this morning. All the natives are scared of her. I've got to get off this world. Has Samara actually done anything yet? The Asari say that Justicars are lethal in a fight. And if they so much as smell corruption, they start shooting. The thing is, corruption isn't that hard to find around here. Tell me how to find the Justicar. She's in the alley where my business partner was murdered. A detective sealed the area, so you'll have to talk with her if you want to go there. Why would these mercs kill him? And why do you think they're coming after you, too? I have no idea. We're innocent merchants. But they killed him, so they must be after me, too. I have to work the angles and get out of here. You don't seem too broken up about your partner's death. Dakni Kerr knew the risks when he took to spacing. Right now, my worry is me. It's unhealthy to be a Volus in the Nosastra spaceport right now. Especially a Volus named Pitney Four. Why do you think it was mercenaries? Dakni Kerr was cutting through a back alley last night when someone killed him with a shotgun. I saw his body this morning. They'd used modded rounds. That means Eclipse Mercs. You must know something about these Eclipse. I occasionally do business with them. But only in well-lit places. With my guards. And only after the creds clear. This is a scummy bunch, even by Merc standards. They sell red sand, all kinds of illegal items. And they are all cold-blooded killers. I should go. Okay. I wanted to be a Justicar when I was young. Every Asari does, I guess. Ah, it's Doctor here. Nice guns. Try not to use them in my district. What can I do for you? Well, I'm first of all, I'll drop my pants. If you've got a score to settle with Samara, take it somewhere else. I've got more than enough trouble here already. I need to recruit Samara for my mission. Then we'll be on our way. Justicars usually work alone, but they are drawn to impossible causes. We've got that covered. If you're getting her out of my district, I'll get you to her ASAP. She's at the crime scene. You're letting her into a sealed crime scene? I'm a cop. I'll work with the Justicar all I can. Besides, she's been looking at crime scenes longer than our two lifespans combined. She knows how to handle herself. You're awfully anxious to get Samara out of your district. My bosses want me to detain her. They're worried she'll cause some kind of cross-species... But her Justicar code won't let her be taken into custody. If I try it, she'll have to kill me. I have no interest in dying, so if you lure her away with some big noble cause before I have to carry out my orders, I'm thrilled to help you. Your superiors are sending you to certain death for no good reason. You have a right to disobey. We can disobey suicidal orders. Why wasn't I told? That's about <laughs> twice a day. That's about twice a day. <laughs> Fuck you, Jarrett. Most of the time, I'm not being stupid about it. I can't say the same for Anaya's superiors. I'm a cop and I know my duty. I've been ordered to detain her and I will. Unless I can get her to leave my district first. How do I get to the crime scene? It's around the corner. Go outside, take a left. Look for the police line. I'll send word to let you in. Be careful. The local Eclipse mercs have been all over those back alleys lately. I have to go. I'm gonna Good kick luck. your ass. We better find Samara before the detective goes after her. I love how, like, they look, they're just like, oh, well, we'll go after her, but she's gonna kill most of us. That's a great idea, people. There's an elevator. Alright, let me in. Anaya told us to let you through. Watch yourself. There's Merc activity back here. We're waiting on backup. Great. Our area, let's consider the extra stock surplus. Ship the rest of Thax at his normal destination. He'll never miss a few lost pieces. Okay. Oh boy. 
Maybe take out my guns right when I walked in the area. That's usually not a good sign. Nothing there. Ooh, I can salvage that. Nice, 3,000 credits. Get the rest of Bravo Squad prepped. Alpha Squad. There goes your fucking head! How many of you had to do that? Yeah. I mean, shooting you in the face is not is not bad. I like shooting you in the face. Shooty. Also, Eclipse Mercs are bitches. What do you got up here? Nothing. Over here, maybe? Nope. Let's go through the door. Ow. Those were my best troops. Tell me what I need to know, and I will be gone from here. Where did you send her? God, you, you think I'd betray her? She would hurt me in ways you can't imagine. The name of the ship. Your life hangs on the answer, Lieutenant. You can kill me, but one of us will take you down, Justicar. Ah, boop. Damn, she's sexy. What was the name of the ship she Did they left make her on? boobs bigger? Go to hell. Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. She did. My name is Samara, a servant of the Justicar Code. My quarrel is with these Eclipse sisters, but I see three well-armed people before me. Are we friend or foe? I'm Commander Shepard, and I need your help with a critical mission, Samara. You honor me, but I am in the middle of an investigation. I'm going up against suicidal odds, and I need the best. That's you. I sense the truth in what you say, and it humbles me. But I seek an incredibly dangerous fugitive. I cornered her here, but the Eclipse sisters smuggled her off-world. I must find the name of the ship she left on before the trail goes cold. I wish you were willing to go with the human, Justicar. I've been ordered to take you into custody if you won't leave. You risk a great deal by following your orders, Detective. Fortunately, I will not have to resist. My code obligates me to cooperate with you for one day. After that, I must return to my investigation. I won't be able to release you that soon. You won't be able to stop me. Uh, the human is lost here. Can one of you clarify? I was trying to convince her to leave with you, but just a car is in their code. The detective has been ordered to detain me. I can't force her to disobey an order. And after a day, Samara fights her way out of custody, killing anyone in her way. I am afraid so. There must be some way we can all get what we need. I see a way. While I am in custody, you find the name of that ship. Do that, and I will join you. Then the code will be satisfied. Do you have any leads? The Volus merchant Pitney Four is tied to this. Eclipse mercs are preparing to kill him. Get the truth out of him. He may know a way into the Eclipse base. Well, I've got to get back to my station. And I guess I've got to take you with me. Thank you, Shepard. You have a sweet rack. Oh, can I go back in here? Damn it, you bitch! Alright, I gotta talk to you. Hello again, Earth Clan. Did you speak to the detective? Look, you spherical jackass. Why are the mercs after you? I know nothing about any mercenaries, Earth Clan. I'm merely an innocent merchant trying to make his way in life. The Eclipse are out for your blood. I need your help to break into their base. Shouldn't we work together? Yes. You're right, Earth Clan. I'm desperate. I've got angry mercs after me, and now this Asari Justicar. Let's talk. 
I smuggled a chemical onto Ilium that boosts biotic powers in combat. It also is toxic. I may have, um, forgotten to mention that to the Eclipse. So they are perturbed and want to kill me. You fucking idiot. It sounds like you're a swindler and your actions finally caught up with you. True and true. But I haven't survived as a merchant this long without being able to tell when there's a deal in the making. You want something. The Eclipse recently smuggled someone off-world. I need the name of the ship she left on. I don't know about their people smuggling operations. They must keep records in their base. I do have a pass card they issued me to bring my goods in. Well, I, I had to return that one, but I happened to make a copy. Give it to me or I punch you in the balls. Take it. Wherever they are. But be careful. Each Eclipse sister commits a murder to earn her uniform. They are all dangerous. No shit, Sherlock. Mars is gonna sit there and meditate. All right, so let's let's see what we're looking at here. Okay, so that's where it is. So it's the elevator that's outside. So all right, we're gonna go activate the elevator and then we'll go down. See what what shenanigans are going on. Right. Yeah. Okay. Now this is open. So now we can activate the elevator. Now we gotta go kill a bunch more Eclipse Mercs. This is gonna be hardcore, gentlemen. All right, we're going down in the hole. Is it quick hit? Hostile! Excuse me. Or not. There we go. Wow, I didn't even have to do anything. Open the door. Mind over matter. Oh, that's red sand. Firing a high impact shot! Unit member offline. Shepard, my scans confirm that the chemical compound will boost biotics. However, concentrated exposure will cause severe tear damage. I recommend limited exposure. Backup options engaged. Look at the power. Mind over matter! Oh, you son of a bitch! Hit her in the balls! There you go. Yeah, shoot her butt when she's on the ground. You have no soul. All right, I gotta check all these. It's a fragile box. I don't know if there's something in there. Could be something in there. Maybe, possibly. Could just be bullshit. Firing a high impact shot. All right, that one's dead. How many of you do I need to shoot? Nothing in any of those. We got this. Ooh. Salt shotgun, I will take that in a heartbeat. Yeah, scimitar salt shotgun. I don't need anything else because I have all the weapons that I need. What's up here? What the hell? What's going on in here? I hear whispering. God, Garris, you got a fucked up face, bro. Do it and die. Wait, stop! I didn't fire my weapon once. I pretended to because the other Eclipse sisters were watching, but I didn't really shoot. Really? I'm not one of them. I'm new. 
I thought being Elnora the mercenary would be cool, but I didn't know what they were really like. You chose your side, Elnora. And you lost. Screw that bastard and screw you! Fuck you! I knew you were full of shit! I knew! Give me my power cells. Now I can nuke people. Ooh. This is valuable. Biotic damage, I'll take that. Bitch, you knew what was gonna happen. You knew what was gonna happen. I had my entire posse there. With guns aimed at you. <laughs> Excuse me. And you had the dumbass idea to pull out a shotgun. That is that is a whole other level of brilliance. Alright, who's next? Here. There they are. Oh god, there's plenty of people in here. Perfect shot. Burn in hell. Firing. Burn in hell. Oh, crap on a stick. Shoot her in the nuts. Ah! I don't think you quite understand what's going to happen to your face. I'll tear you apart. Understood. It will be done. You have nothing. Alright, I think I got all of them with that, it seems like. Or at least the, the ones in that immediate group. Let's just do a quick eyeball around. Nothing else here. Okay, that just leads right down there. So I think we got everything so far. Keep an eye out as usual. There are some ones that are a bit tricky. Upstairs. What's over here, though? Oh, I can hack that. I can hack it. All right, let's see. That one. Nope. Nope. Still nope. There we go. Got it. Three thousand credits. I'll take that. We got some decent credits after this. Like a decent amount of them, anyway. All right, going upstairs. Sensors activated. Get your ass in the hole. I'm on it. Mind over matter. Scoped and dropped. hostile. Down. Inhale. Any more of you? On this level, maybe not. How did I access that square? Okay, as long as I can go over that, so I'm kind of stuck here. Right, so let's access the terminal. Right, that gave me 6,000 credits, thank you. Now we can head up here. saying about integrity Oh hi there You 
using my shit. He's down. Alright, hang on a quick second. Alright, I'm just gonna pause this for a quick second and I'll be right back. Alright, so we're back. And we're midway through Samara's mission. So this isn't too bad. We have to keep going. Alright. Fuck Eclipse Marks. Eclipse Marks are bitches. Weakening their integrity! Literally, at the Eclipse forever! Well, forever is forever for you. Dear God, I love this gun. And you're dead. Engaging hostile! Deploying more field! Firing a high impact shot! As I must. And she's dead. I do think it's funny how the eyes literally cross when you shoot them in the face. Just all that lack of motor function. Anything in there? Anything in there? Looks like I don't have anything else in here to snag. I did use up the last of my sniper ammo, but fuck it. This, this, this has got to be almost. We still have to go kill the sisters, but that's not too bad. Because I can just nuke those bitches. I got power cells. It's always helpful. Well, it's official. Little baby Elnora is finally a full-fledged Eclipse Merc. I earned my uniform last night when I killed that ridiculous Volus. Oh. A close exploding rounds. Blew the little bastard's suit wide open. <laughs> I can't wait to see some real action. Next time I go home, my friends are going to be so jealous. Well. Elnora was the killer. You were right to be suspicious of her. Detective and I would be interested in this. Yes, yes, she would. All right. Where are your little bastards? I'm blasting these open because I can't remember if there is something that is uh, hidden in some of these. Doesn't appear so, at least not on this side. Are you ready for the new gang? Gunship above. I missed much. Well, I fucked that up. Let's take out the sniper rifle again. Do it the old fashioned way. Come on. 
burning hell. Fucking dogs. Any more of you? Anybody else want to die today? Well, that gunship, uh, well, I mean, I, I, I fucked up with the nuclear gun. I apologize for that. That was a, that was a colossal mess up. All right. But we made it through. Give me that. Anything on this side that I'm gonna miss? Look like anything is left here. Alright, so we will continue on. I'm gonna bypass the door. Just kind of bypass. There we go. Definitely bypassed. Doesn't seem to be any other way out of here. Credits. This shipping looks credits. like a shipping manifest. It shows the Pitney 4 sold 2,000 units of Minigen X3 to the Eclipse, along with 600 units of red sand. This isn't the information Samara needs, but it proves the Volus is a criminal. I'm sure Detective and I would be interested in this. We've got to keep moving. Yep, she will be interested in it, because we're going to throw that mother in jail. You. What? I am a biotic god. I think things, and they happen. Fear me, lesser creatures, for I am biotics made flesh. You need help. You need help. For you stand before the mightiest biotic ever. Yes, the Asari injecting so many drugs into me was terrifying. But then I began to smell my greatness. Did you shit yourself? They may laugh when I fall over. But they don't know what I know in my head. That I know that I am amazingly powerful. Fear me! Are you part of Pitney 4's trade group? When I was mortal, I worked for Pitney. Poor soul is probably terrified that I have not returned. He hasn't reported your disappearance. Probably so his departure won't get delayed. I get the distinct impression Pitney prefers money to friends. Bah! I will wreak a just revenge upon his people. But first... The leader of these mercenaries is in the next room. I shall toss Wasea about like a rag doll. Shepard, this guy couldn't tie his bootlaces, much less fight. I will tear her apart. My biotics are unstoppable. Wasea will tear you apart. Take a nap. You'll feel better. Are you mad? I'm unstoppable. Feasting on her biotic rich blood will be the last step. But great wind. Biotic god. I'm I What was I saying? I'm tired. You may be right. Yes, I'm tired. I'll nap. Destroy the universe later. That dude's fucked. So much for godhood. Well, I mean, we didn't let him run into a hail of bullets, which, honestly, that probably would have been a hell of a lot funnier, but still. Give me some metagel. Load out. Alright, bitches. 
I'm here to fuck your face. Everything's gone to hell since we smuggled that filthy creature off world. First a Justicar shows up. Now you. At least I can take pleasure in turning your head into a pulpy mass. Look out! <clears throat> Ready to get your face budged? Some record of that ship must be around here. I need to make sure there's nothing in here that I'm going to miss. Yay, nay. That's definitely the data pad I need to grab. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Easy enough. Three thousand credits. Never have too much credits. All right, let's take it. There's just a car here, probably looking for one for the one we sent off on the AML Demeter. I was happy to see her go. She chilled me to the bone. I just hope this Justicar doesn't mess up my operation. That must be the ship Samara was looking for. Should we head back to the police station and give her the name? Or look around first? Ah, uh, let's go. We've looked around enough. Let's give her the name and keep moving. I think we've already explored that room pretty good before we bothered to go grab that, so I think we're okay. And hopefully she'll give us some credits and we can go to this back to the Ilium stores and buy some more crap. All right. So we're now we're back out. So let's go talk to uh your stupid bitch. If you have something that'll encourage the Justicar to leave, show it to her. Thank you for removing the eclipse threat, Earth Clan. It will take them months to rebuild their organization. Also, merely out of curiosity, when you were poking about, did you perhaps run across a shipping manifest that belongs to me? You never know when something like this might come in handy. If it might change your mind, Earth Clan, returning that manifest would be very profitable for you. If you give it to the detective, her reward will be a pat on the back. Shut up. If you have something that'll encourage the just... I've got the name of the ship. Your fugitive left here two days ago on the AML Demeter. Shepard, you impress me. You fulfilled your part of the bargain, and I will fulfill mine. I am ready to leave immediately, if that will satisfy your superiors, Detective. You're free to go, Justicar. It has been an honor having you in my station. And it's nice you didn't kill me, too. The Normandy is docked near the main trading floor. I'll see you aboard. I must be sworn to your service so that I am never forced to choose between your orders and the code. By the code, I will serve you, Shepard. Your choices are my choices. Your morals are my morals. Your wishes are my code. I never thought I'd see a Justicar swear an oath like that. If you make me do anything extremely dishonorable, I may need to kill you when I'm released from my oath. 
I can see that this is a very important act, Samara. Thank you. Truly, the life of a Justicar can get lonely. I admit I am looking forward to serving with a company of honorable heroes. Shall we return to your ship? I need to speak to the detective. Thanks for getting Samara out of my district. I can tell my granddaughters about meeting a Justicar. And you've just upped my chances of living long enough to have grandkids. I have proof that Eclipse killed the Volus merchant. Let's see what you've got there. Interesting. But I can't verify it. It would be inadmissible. I vouch for Shepard, and any evidence he brings forward. I accept the judgment of the Justicar. Thanks, Shepard. I wasn't sure about trusting a stranger, and a human at that. But you came through. Never heard of this Elnora. Sounds like she was just starting her career. Good thing you cut it short. Okay, enough with all the congratulations. I've still got a spiraling crime rate. I have proof that Pitney Four smuggled in red sand and illegal weapons tech. I'll send in some officers to arrest him and his cohorts. This is a big help, Shepard. I can't do much to thank you, but we do have a small discretionary bounty fund. Take this. All right, I'm going to return to uh, the Normandy with Samara. Yeah. Welcome to the Normandy, Samara. We've studied your profile extensively. With your skills, I think you'll be an excellent addition to our team. Thank you. From an organization such as yours, that is high praise indeed. I've seen Samara's biotic powers at work. They're substantial. We still don't know what we're going to find when we hit the Collectors. I will be prepared for whatever we encounter. Where shall we put you? A room that looks out on the great empty void would be most comforting. Put her in the observation room on Deck 3. Thank you. I must meditate on the day's events. That's a, such a nice ass. Fuck off, Jacob. Okay, so uh, let's check our time. All right, our time's pretty good, so we're going to go down and we're going to talk to Samara. Actually, we're going to do a little bit of upgrading, then we're going to go down and talk to Samara. There we go. Decent amount. Shut up, Kelly. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Shut up, Kelly. Okay. Let's go to the observation deck. Chit chat with Samara. Shepard. Do you have any suggestions about using some of the resources we've gathered? I believe I can use some of them to increase our fuel reserves so we can explore further. Shall I tell you what is required? Show me what it would take. All right. All right, extended fuel cells. There we go. Perfect. Now let's talk. Shepard. Can you do How that? are you? Can you do I've that to my I've spent much of the last 400 years on my own. It is nice to have a colleague to chat with. I may be rusty at it, however. If you are patient, I would love to talk. How much do you know about our mission? I know that I've sworn an oath to follow you, and that you seek to destroy the Collectors. That is enough for me. You don't want to know why the Collectors need to be fought? When you live by a code that compels you to harsh action, you learn the dangers of curiosity. If I must kill a man because he has done wrong, do I really wish to know that he is a devoted father? I'd like to hear more about the criminal you were chasing on Nos Astra. I hope you will understand if I wish to avoid this topic. 
It is deeply tied to my code and beliefs. You might say it is personal. What do you think of Serpent? I've heard rumors, but learned long ago to form my own impressions. There is too much room for interpretation in the opinions of others. I should get back to work. It has been my pleasure, Commander. Alright, so that increased our uh, helium thruster, whatever the hell it is. Let's go talk to Thane. Nope, not there. I wonder if he has his loyalty mission for us yet. Shepard. Is there something wrong? Yes. Now that you are here, though, uh, it seems more difficult to talk about. I've got time. Take it at your own pace. Thank you. I fear I've already done that for too long. I had a family once. I still have a son. His name is Kolyat. I haven't seen him for a very long time. Did something happen to them? I abandoned them. Oh, not all at once. Nothing dramatic, no sneaking out in the middle of the night. No final argument or slammed door. I just did my job. I hunted and killed across the galaxy. Away on business, my wife would tell people. I was always away on business. How long has it been since you talked? Ten years. He showed me some of his schoolwork and asked if we could dance crazy. We did that when he was younger. What sort of dance is that? It's... I checked my extranet contacts. I expect an update on my next target. The console plays music. Oh, unfashionable. Kolyat jumps into the room. My father runs around in circles. I scoop him up, toss him into the air. He shrieks, laughs, spin me. The console beeps. I put him down. Click the message. Father, he pleads, tugs my sleeve. I need to read this, I say. I don't look at him. You never mentioned this before. Why now? When my wife departed from her body, I attended to that issue. I left Kolyat in the care of his aunts and uncles. I have not seen him or talked to him since. Well, that's not the choice I expected. Why didn't you raise him yourself? My body is blessed with the skills to take life. The Hanar honed them in me. I have few others. I didn't want that life for Kolyat. I hoped he would find his own way. If he hated me, so be it. He would not have shared the path of sin. I used my contacts to trace Kolyat. He has become disconnected. He does what his body wills. You'll have to explain that one to me. Disconnected. The body is not our true self. The soul is. Body and soul work as one in a whole person. When the soul is weakened by despair or fear, when the body is ill or injured, the individual is disconnected, no longer whole. What's wrong with him? Is he hurt? Something happened that should not have. He knows where I've been, what I've done. I don't know his reasons, but he has gone to the Citadel. He's taken a job as a hitman. I would like your help to stop him. He is... This is not a path he should walk. I'll get us to the Citadel as soon as possible. Thank you, Shepard. I'll be meditating until you need me. Okay, so that's Thane's loyalty quest, which we'll have to do on the Citadel along with Garrus's. Um... I don't think there's anything else to really talk with people about at the moment. So we're gonna go back upstairs. Actually, we're gonna go to the captain's cabin because I need to I need to feed my one fish. The fish I put in here. He's he, oh they're alive, thank god. Feed them. Feed the fish. Thank god. Alright, private messages. You changed my life. Jeert. Greetings, Commander Shepard. Liara Tassoni gave me your contact information. I was one of the cleaning crew in the Dantius Towers. Okay, so he's one of the people we saved. He helped me get out of there. According to Tassoni, you also found Thane. He took down some of the Eclipse mercs trying to gun us down, and I wondered if you could pass along my thanks. The way he moved, one was dead before they even knew he was there. He snapped another's neck, then shot a third, all in the space of a few heartbeats. It was incredible. He moved like a dancer, grace and power in constant motion. Seeing him change my life woke up something in me. I don't fully understand yet. I don't know what I'm going to do, but Solarian lives are too short to waste as custodians, especially when there's so much else out there. I'm going to find something that lets me capture what I saw in him, that beauty, that aesthetic perfection. 
I'm also going to buy some nice clothes. So if you could tell him that or just whatever parts of that you think appropriate, I'd appreciate it. Sincerely, Jeert. Okay, so well, that's him. Uh, all right, so we're going to go back. Actually, no, you know what? We're going to go. We're going to customize our armor a little bit because we got some new armor parts from Ilium. And I think we need to go back to Ilium, too, because uh, we're going to need to um, do the Liara to Sony quest. Okay, I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. All right, so what it, what does the hood look like, though? That's the Kestrel helmet. Ah, uh, no. I'll skip that. I'll, I'll, I'll stick with my Gimp mask, but I do like that, so I'll keep that. Okay, let's go back down. Like I said, we got to go back onto Ilium. So we're going to go back onto Ilium, and I think that'll probably run us out. What do you want, Kelly? Are you going to say anything to me, Kelly? Are you going to say anything? Alright, let's go back to Ilium. We still have to help... Well, while we're here, we might as well help Miranda and... Uh, and also do the stuff with uh, Liara. So I think what we'll do is we're going to hop back down here. So let's add... So if we're going to do stuff with Miranda, let's add Miranda and we'll take... Actually, yeah. We'll do Miranda and Garrus. Oh, she has a good amount. Purchase that and purchase that. Let's go with Heavy Overload. All concussive shot, heavy concussive shot. We're gonna do that because I remember that that's the better of the two. Okay. Excuse me, my sources indicate you were in a warehouse recently. Did you by any chance forward a questionable shipping note to a Mr. Thax? It looked suspicious, so I passed it on. I'm a representative for Mr. Thax. He's very grateful to you. Please accept this as a gift for bringing the shipping irregularities to his attention. What happens to the shipping agent who is cheating Thax? That depends on how sincere her apology is, and how willing she is to correct a mistake. Do you want help finding the person who cheated Thax? Thank you, but that won't be necessary. Mr. Thax will be making a series of polite calls. Hopefully a confrontation will not be required. It was my pleasure. Have a pleasant day. Okay. Thank you. I have a message for Miss Lawson. Lantea has reserved a room at Eternity and will be waiting. Thank you, Edie. Okay, so that's the contact for Miranda's quest. Okay, and I just have to bring her along to activate that. Uh, so let's take a look here at some of these. You have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. No, you don't understand! I lost it somewhere. Are you sure these I did it after Pardon me, I'm on a call. Okay. I've been in short sell on prefabs after these human colony attacks. All right, let's see here. So what else do I have to get from here? Biotic damage or tech damage. All right, let's get let's do the biotic damage. Okay, I can't really do much more with that. Let's do it. So well, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna what's what time? What time am I working with? All right, that I, I think I think that's enough for a session. Uh, so we'll stop it here, and we'll come back next time. And next time, we will do the oh, Shadow Broker course, DLC, or at least start the Shadow Broker DLC. I just need to make a call. So we I will see you have... next time with Check more Mass Effect. Bye-bye.